doing another food steamer. I'll have to ask him about that. Pat says happy Thanksgiving. Um, we've got lots of things going on in the kitchen. All right, so now we are switching gears. Chef Errol Lagasse's back. He's gonna help you kick it up a notch for your Thanksgiving holiday and so much more. I am affectionately known as the pressure cooking queen here at HSN. I have lost count of how many pressure cookers I have, but I don't have this. This is genius because I love the taste, the health, the speed, the moisture, the, the juice that you get with pressure cooking. I don't like how gray sometimes things can look, so I, I use my air fryer for that. This is a two-in-one, actually a three-in-one, because you could use it for your soups, you could use it for your rices, you could use it for your rice pudding. But do you know it will do all of that? So do your pressure cooking like 70% faster, but then you get an air frying lid as well. It is here only for a limited quantity. Now, we're gonna do a this day only price, a price that is only good for my show. What do you think? Air fryer, $1.99, right? Pressure cooker, you know, $169. What if you're getting both? What if it's a three in one, four in one? Okay, we have what, Steve, only like 700 of those, something like that? Okay, fewer than 1,000, that's gonna be coming up. And please help me welcome to the show the man that everybody has been talking about, I told him earlier he has been the talk of HSN. Of course, we've known and watched him for years and maybe you even remember when he was at HSN then went to our sister partner family QVC and I've been loving him for afar on all of his infomercials and all that great stuff. We have the one, the only, the inimitable Chef Emeril Lagasse who is back here at HSN. And I gotta tell you, Chef, First of all, we are all sending you so much love. How you doing? I'm doing great, Shannon. Thank you so much. I'm so excited about working with you this evening. I'm so excited about being back in the family of HSN. So um, I'm gonna let you just begin. Let's do it. Okay, we're gonna kick it up a notch and, and this is appropriately named. I know that Alice had this on earlier. First of all, you want a meat -a ball. Uh, oh, by the way, Chef also has the pasta maker that debuted earlier today. And let me just tell you, everybody wants this in, its show, in their show. That's coming up. So he's gonna do, you know, like surf and turf, we're gonna do meatballs and pasta. The pasta's coming up. First and foremost, this is a very specialized handcrafted recipe as only Chef Emeril Lagasse can do. But you are getting your 18 meatballs. They come in three packs of six, three packs of six to total up to 18. And then it comes with the gravy as, uh, as Alice was saying earlier. And that's you know part of the fun. That's part of the, the best part. So you just choose, do you want it in immediate shipment or do you want it a little closer to the holidays? And Steve, on that um, uh, extended, or I should say the, uh, the auto ship, okay, so we're gonna give you just an exact date. So we have a November shipment, and then I, I think it's December, oh shoot, I'm trying to do this from memory. Um, my producer is actually gonna look that up for me. Either way, you want it, and they were wildly popular. Uh, of course, Chef, I'm gonna defer to you in your beautiful kitchen. I was, I was fangirling not only on you, but on that kitchen as well. So people need to understand, this is a specialized, really a handcrafted recipe. You can't mess this up, whether it's sliders, whether it's enjoying it on the fresh pasta we're making later. This, this is like having you cook for us in, in our home, isn't it? Well, you're gonna get a little bit of emerald right coming to your doorstep. As you said, Shannon, this is a very, very special recipe. Each meatball is rolled by hand. So this is not, not machine made. It's my recipe, they're delicious. It's a really a quality blend of ground beef, sweet Italian sausage, Parmesan cheese, garlic, Italian herbs, and just a little bit of breadcrumbs to bind it. They come to you, 18 meatballs, six in a pouch. Now, if you don't want to thaw them, you can take them right out of the freezer and you just put them right into some simmering water for about 30 minutes. So we've done that and we have them and they slowly start simmering in this very rich, delicious tomato sauce with a hint of crushed red pepper, basil, oregano, a little bit of red wine for acidity. Then those meatballs simmer in there, we cool them, we put them in the pouch, three packs come to your door, 18 meatballs. 
This is the size of 18 meatballs. Look at that. That would feed really a large family, uh, whatever you do with them, whether you're gonna make a, a, a meatball pizza or you're gonna make a, a meatball penne bake or whether you're gonna make sliders for the kids. Let me tell you, my kids love this and they're really simple to prepare. But what I wanna show you is this. You've got a lot of talk going on. We had some that came out and I'm gonna show the folks at home one meatball and then I'm gonna show you a little emerald trick. So I have the meatball and you can see just the steam coming out. Beautiful, beautiful tomato sauce. But what I like to do, Shannon, is I like to just dust it with a little bit of grated Parmesan cheese and then I like to just go for the bite. Go for it, my friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> mm. Oh, my God. They are delicious. <laughs> and you just have to let your imagination run wild of what you want to do with meatballs. It, it's true. Hey, by the way, we did get an exact date on that December delivery. So November ship date or the, uh, we call it auto ship or the future delivery. That's actually 12-3, so December 3rd. So here's the thing. So you can sign up for that auto ship. Now on the auto ship, we only have about 200. Okay, fair warning, that's the best way to go. Uh, actually fewer than 200 and actually fewer than 100 on the immediate shipment. Um, just so you understand though, well, I think we all know the challenges with, especially with meat and you know, all the challenges of is it in, is it not in. First of all, El Emerald does all the heavy lifting for you. He does all the work. And when you see this, not only the size, but the gravy, the gravy, the gravy, that is part of the, the amazing job. It's like having him cook for you. Emerald is in your kitchen. He's making meatballs for you. That's what he's doing. And all you do is warm them up. That's it. So by the way, uh, Teresa, Teresa is a red wine fan. That's perfect with this, by the way, Teresa. Um, uh, Deborah, I know now that we've got Wolfgang, or Wolfgang and Emerald and, and Curtis Stone here, I know Emerald is going to be working on getting his food on the air. We're just starting, you know, as best we can. Hi there, Shady, uh, to you and Pat and Barbara. But when I look at these, Emerald, no kidding, they're juicy, they're flavorful, they are packed with a punch. Look at how moist, look at how succulent that is. And because you're getting three packs of six, whether you live alone like I do or whether you wanna cook for a crowd, Let's be honest, meatballs, just like the pasta that we're gonna be making fresh, those are crowd pleasers. Um, when I saw you showing the ingredients earlier though, Chef, I was really impressed because I, meatballs are a real, just like pasta, they, they require a real finesse. It's like for the mix, for the blend, for the gravy, that's like a whole other situation. You're, you're, you're you're, right? You're absolutely correct. Oh, okay, I'm going in. There's, there's abs you're absolutely correct. First, we start with the quality ingredients. Ground meat, sweet Italian sausage, herb spices, then we hand roll them. Can you taste that love when you, when, when you taste that? Oh man, and, yeah. And, and, and this is emerald coming to your doorstep. This is the real deal. Yeah. We, you, you, you take them, you, you put them in the, in the pot of simmering water or you thaw them out. That sauce is just so, look at the sauce. The sauce is just, you know, just tomato, a little bit of crushed pepper, some Italian herbs. It simmers with those meatballs. I just, I'm glad, I'm glad you got a bite, Shannon. Oh man, chef, I'm telling you, everybody is so jealous because and now it's gonna be hard to talk because they are so full of flavor. I mean, literally my mouth is watering and I don't know, it's so interesting because when I keep saying, Emerald's coming to your house and cooking for you. That's what this is. I mean, you are coming, <laughs> Chef Emerald Lagasse, kicking it up a notch. He's coming to your house. He's making meatballs for you. That's what he's doing. And when you team it up with the fresh pasta that we're gonna be making later in the show, fair warning, that pasta maker, Amy and Adam are supposed to air it in their Thanksgiving show. Uh, good luck. Because when it debuted earlier with Alice, they sold a lot more than they were supposed to. Um, man, in fact, I can't even talk. These are just so full of flavor. Wow, those are good. <laughs> even my producer is saying, 
that he, he's gonna have to move off this just so that he can steal one. We all want these. Remember, three packs of six. You choose it in the immediate or you choose it in the December delivery and then you choose it on a uh, single or auto ship. And that advanced delivery is actually December 3rd. Still get a money back guarantee. You might not realize that until the end of January. And then flex pay, $15.79. Those are interest-free payments on your major credit card. Hey, um, a lot of you are asking about uh, stakes and you know all the great things that maybe you've seen on our sister partner network. Well, now that we've got Chef here again, we're gonna we're gonna share with everybody. I know we're gonna work on getting some more things. Hey, by the way, Sam, you are always so sweet. Tony, Miss Barbara, she, she's all, we're all craving meatballs. Hi there, Mary um, and Mag. Nice to have you here, Donna. We see you. Hey, forty dollars off when you apply and buy and get that HSN card. That is our largest incentive or promotion that we do on our HSN credit card. Okay, we are moving along. And I love to be in the kitchen with you. I'm Shannon. I am with Chef Emeril Lagasse for the next hour. His pasta maker to go with the meatballs coming up in just a few minutes. Now, this is my gotta have it. I consider myself kind of the pressure cooker queen here at HSN. I love how fast, I love how flavorful, I love how healthy it is, as if that weren't enough. But you know, when you're doing things like a pot roast um, or even braising like meat or doing ribs, things don't necessarily have that car caramelized color that we expect in the oven, but doggone it, we love how moist they are. What if I told you I could get you both? What if I told you I could get the world-class quality of Chef Emeril, making its debut at a this day only price, only for me, only for this show, only as long as the next couple hundred are available? What would you spend for an air fryer? $189, $199. What'd you spend for a good Chef Emeril Lagasse pressure cooker? Same thing, $159, $169, because this is the six quart capacity, six quart capacity, which I call the Goldilocks. So you'll notice there are a bunch of lids. You wanna know why? It's a set it and forget it machine with all the presets, has your cook and look, because you can use it as a soup terrine and soup server. You get the pressure cooking lid, you get the air fryer lid. It does both. It's the lowest price you're gonna find. Do you know what? Let's show you. It is for this show. Oh, and you get a recipe booklet as well. For this show, $119.99. Can, can you tell how crazy I am about this? So we have few, basically the last 500. Um, incidentally, you're also getting the elevated rack, which is great if you're roasting things, your measurer. And then I love this basket too, because remember you can also steam vegetables and do all those wonderful things. You could do desserts. Um, and then you are getting a recipe guide and booklet in this as well. Uh, Chef, I have to dis defer to you. Do you know, there were so many people who pre-ordered on this. I'm a super fan of yours, but no kidding. So I can caramelize. I I can crisp, I can cook fast, I can serve. This does everything but the dishes, right? Well, you know, the thing is, Shannon, like you said, this has 44 different things that it can do, 44 different settings with the push of a button. This is the six quart pressure cooker, but the cool thing is, is that it, don't, it doesn't only air, uh, pressure cook, it air fries. You just change the lid, which we're gonna show you very shortly, and you get that crisp food on the outside and the juiciness in the inside. You know, pressure cooking is for tender, juicy results. And this pressure cooker cooks up to 70% faster than traditional appliances. Promise you that. You just put on the switch, plug it in, turn the switch on, and you can either pressure cook or air fry, which we're gonna show you. Look at some of the dishes that we've done in, in this uh, prior to coming on with Shannon. We made ribs. We did air fried french fries. I'm gonna show you this really cool turkey or chicken that you can do where we begin to start pressure cooking it for about 10 or 15 minutes, then we switch the lid off and then we air fry it to get that really crispy, crispy uh, finish. It's amazing what you can do here, folks. And the great thing is, I, I wanna show you this. It's a little warm. Just wanna show you, this is, this is the chicken that we did earlier and then we, then we air fried it. Now, oh. can, you, can you see that now? Oh, chef, that looks you great. See? Yeah, so we, we pressure cooked it for 15 minutes, then we switched the lid off, 
and now we're air frying it to get that really crispy skin on the outside and that delicious moist juiciness on the inside. Hey, chef, do you know Sandy is loving this? Uh, she said it's genius. Even Shady says 44 presets. Yeah, I know. Uh, Pat, you're right. What a good price. They're doing this for me and they're doing this for you because remember, it's really more than a three in one with those uh, 44 different presets. So you know what these combination units sell for. It's a lot more than $119. I'll tell you that because if you just consider how much you would spend for one of these pressure cooking air fryers, it's both. So, of course, you get your air frying lid, you get your pressure cooking lid, you also get the cook and look lid. Remember, this is a stainless steel insert. It is a six quart, which I call the tweener, or I should call it, uh, say, the Goldilocks size. And you will do everything from, you could do corned beef and cabbage, you could do your corn on the cob, you can steam vegetables, because you get that great little steamer basket. You get the elevated rack that Chef was just showing you with the chicken, the measurer, of course, the ladle, and then the recipe guide as well. And they are going. I'll just tell you this. I think we have fewer than 500 of them now available. And this is, to my knowledge, the only Aaron. And I'm not sure, but I do, I'm not sure if Amy and Adam have this in their Thanksgiving show. All I know is I've got it now. And if you apply and buy, as if that $119 price wasn't good enough, you could actually take $40 off upon approval on that first purchase. You get our unconditional, there's a money back guarantee until the end of January, and then you can float those payments. So you can get it at home, use this for Hanukkah, use this for New Year's Eve, use it for Christmas, use it for Christmas Eve, use it for Thanksgiving. But the whole point is you will use it. So those are interest-free payments, $24 on your credit card, but we zip it off to you right away. Um, we're working on plugging this in. And then, um, uh, Chef, I, I know you've got some great demonstrations, but I love how everything is really labeled, too. I know you get a great recipe guide, but it's kind of nice to set it and forget it. I don't know about you, but it's fun to just push a button and let the machine do all the work, isn't it? Yeah, exactly right. And, you, you know, you, you, this thing is just so fast. It's like a whirlwind of, of superheated hot air, uh, like I said. You know, the great thing, Shannon, is that 44 presets. So that's really the touch of a button. 44 preset cooking functions is unbelievable. You know, we use this at least once, sometimes twice a week in, in our house. This is one of my favorites that I want to show you that we made. This is a chicken pot pie. And look at, look at the capacity. Look at the capacity that this thing has inside of this pressure cooker. It's unbelievable. You know how many people that you could feed with that? Yeah. And don't worry about if you have leftovers. That's not going to go anywhere. You just let it cool, put it in your refrigerator, and then maybe you want to have it tomorrow for lunch, or maybe you want to have it again tomorrow night for dinner and just get a little bit creative with it. This is one of my favorites. I'll tell you that right now, Shannon. So tasty. It's all done right in the pressure cooker. Hey. I, 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 I just get amazed when I, when I think about 44 presets. No kidding. Hey, Chef, how big was that chicken that you did? Is that like a six pound chicken that you did in the pressure cooker? Do you know offhand? Yes, uh, it, it's, it's a full, full fledged uh, frying bird. Uh, and I put some carrots and a little bit of potatoes. And then we, like I said, we pressure cook it first and then we air fried it so that it gets all nice and crispy. And that rack that comes with it that you talk about. Claire, you wanna just set that right here? I sure do. Great. Chef Claire, <laughs> look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my goodness, mm -mm -mm. I'll, I'll tell you what. It's uh, amazing. I'll tell you another thing uh, that my, my kids and their friends when they come over the house that they love, and that's just amazing pulled pork. And so what we did, Shannon, is that we just took a couple of pork butts and we put them inside of the, the pressure cooker. Look at, look at that. Oh my I, gosh. I mean, the, uh, uh, you, wanna, you wanna do sandwiches, you wanna, you wanna put it in, in with pasta, you, you wanna just eat it with mashed potatoes. I mean, look at that, folks. Wow. That's how tender, that's how tender that it just cooks like that. I'm fascinated every time that I use this, this, this appliance. It's just really amazing. It is, hey, only about 400 to go around. Uh, by the way, Gail, you kinda read my mind. I do, I can as well. Yes, you can can in this 
it's the pressure cooker that can. It's the air fryer that can. Uh, so you can see, so here are your various functions. So your pressure, um, by the way, oh geez, I forgot, it's a sous vide machine. I have sold just sous vide, I'm telling you, you've probably seen them, I won't say the brand names, for $1.99. So you can sous vide in this. Steam, now remember you get that steamer basket, so uh, rice, your quinoas, your steel cut oats, if you're trying to do all those healthy grains. Now, it gets hot enough, and here's what's genius, you can saute, this is your one pot cooking, I'm serious, but not only that, now you're air frying, it's a sous vide, and it's a timer. Uh, sorry about that, Dix, I don't know if that's a great shot of me, but <laughs> listen, I'm taking one for the team. You gotta come out and hit the control panel. Um, here's your delayed timer. Now you can override, there's a temperature adjustment, but now remember, it's also a slow cooker. There's that air fry function. Now do you notice, um, you can actually customize that, whether you're doing beef, whether you're doing poultry, whether you're doing fish. Gale, 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 there's your canning function. Can you guys see that? There's, uh, the studios are so bright, let me hit that again. Um, but if you can see, the time, I don't know if that's showing really good at, on the camera or not, but then you can also do yogurt in this, it's genius. You can actually do those desserts. And then the meat the balls, there's your keep warm function. So if you wanna keep that gravy nice and piping hot, then there's even a keep warm function. And that's just the pressure cooker, rice cooker, sous vide, dessert maker, yogurt maker. I actually had a, uh, a yogurt maker on the air recently. It was just, a, I shouldn't say just, um, but it was a yogurt maker for 100 bucks. So if we just took the value of the multitasking pressure cooker, fewer than 400, there's your pressure cooking lid, there's your air frying lid, because when Chef was doing the roasted chicken, did you notice it had that nice crispy skin? See, I love a pressure cooker, but what I don't love is chicken in particular, it cooks it fast and it's juicy and it's flavorful and it's moist, but then um, the skin isn't crispy. And visually, plus from a taste function, you want that. Plus the cook and look lid. Okay, chef, what? What's going on in your kitchen right there? Well, well, Claire, Claire, she just made some pulled pork, uh, little little sandwiches, little sliders, because the crew is getting they're getting antsy. I'll tell you what, they, they've been smelling all of this, but I know one of your favorite foods is mac and cheese, and I just want to show you, we made you a killer mac and cheese. Look at that. You see how just nice and moist? And look at the quantity again, folks. You can pressure cook and air fry in one pot. And like Shannon was saying, it's one pot meals all the way. The family's gonna love it. One of the things, Shannon, that I that I like, there's a lot of young people uh, that, that are wanting to cook and, and that wanna get involved with mom and dad or grandma and grandpa. This is another perfect, because we, we, we've taken all the fright out of this, okay? Years and years ago, as you know, pressure cookers had a bad rap because they would like, you know, it was like a rocket ship. We have done with technology and, and, and eliminated all of that stuff so that you can just feel comfortable cooking all of these functions at home with the family. Involve the kids. Let them, let them season that, that pork butt. Let them put it inside of the pressure cooker. Show them how to work. There's no open, there's no open flames, there's no blades. So it's really just, uh, really up to you what you want to cook. It's really true. Really fantastic. Chef, people are yep. loving this. We have fewer than 400. In fact, Steve, I think if we took everybody into consideration, we have hundreds and hundreds of people calling. We'll let you know when it's, it will sell out. <laughs> this is, to my knowledge, the only airing. And everybody is so impressed, Chef, with what it does. Uh, by the way, we got our food fans and posse out there tonight because Martina was asking if it can sear. And it was funny, uh, Sherry and Barbara, you know, we've got all our food fans who are helping to answer questions in um, uh, Facebook Live. The question of the day or for the show to win $25 gift card is red or white. That could apply to what you're making the pressure cooker or the pasta maker or your Thanksgiving dinner, red or white and wine. We've got wine next hour. But remember, it's a set it and forget it machine. Six quart capacity to me is the ultimate. There's that slow cooker. Let me just kind of hit some of the functions again. You can always override if you really want to get, um, you know, specific, but there again, the sous vide, that blows me away. I forgot that it did that. So you know chefs love that. If you ever do those little um, 
eggs, uh, you know, the little sous vide eggs that they have at that coffee shop. You can do that. There's your steam. There's that saute. That's what Martina was asking about. So yes, you can saute. Your delayed timer, you can adjust your temperature, air fry, canning, yogurt. I've sold yogurt makers very recently, in fact, for about $100. Pasta makers around the corner. Remember, the price is good now. And those are interest-free payments. So you can apply and buy, in which case you'd get $40 off on that first purchase, 780416. So you can qualify for that purchase for the next four hours. But Steve, we're looking at what, final 300 now? Okay. Okay, with everyone who is joining us, we have a, a little over 100, about 150. So we know that every single one of them... <laughs> Beverly, I like the pebbles and bam bam comment. You know, maybe we'll have to do that. I, I sometimes to do Cindy Lou Who. <laughs> That's a whole different character. Um, oh, Susan likes white wine. Hi there, Sherry. She likes red. Um, Shady likes her rose. Well, rose, red or white, you're going to love the pasta maker um, because it is a crowd pleaser. It's coming up next. Stay tuned. Celebrate the holidays your way as HSN and QVC present the $50,000 Holiday Sweepstakes. Enter daily for a chance to win the $50,000 grand prize. Plus, play our instant win game for a chance to win other prizes from hot brands. Visit hsn.com and search sweepstakes. With only seven weeks left till Christmas, let us lighten your holiday load with HSN's Slay the Deals Weekend. We have all the Apple products on everyone's list, on five flex pay and free shipping, and four or more flex pay on all cookware and food to make your holiday feast stress-free. Plus four select sale prices on everything from fashion to footwear, even gifts for him. And new products from Diane Gilman, Bear Paw, and Bissell. So grab that list, get your hot cocoa, and join us. Slay the Deals Weekend tonight at midnight on HSN and at hsn.com. Our HSN price is a great value that we bring to you every day. We work hard and have the buying power to make sure it's a value that you'll love. So go ahead, treat yourself with the confidence to buy now at the HSN price. cooking event here at HSN. I'm delighted to have you here. I'm Shannon and we do this show every Friday at seven o'clock. Tonight we started a little early, but we have all our triple threat. Of course, we had Wolfgang last hour. Chef Emeril is back here at HSN. And then Curtis Stone is going to be here. <laughs> Don't tempt me. They, we got wines next hour, but when it comes to pasta, pasta, of course, really takes finesse and know-how no more. You are starting a family tradition that I can promise you is a crowd pleaser for generations, but it also puts you in the driver's seat with regard to dietary, you know, restrictions or challenges. You can do gluten-free pasta. You could add your favorite beet juice. You could do pumpkin pasta, butternut squash pasta. And you know what I love best about all of this? You hit a button. I'm serious about that. You hit a button. This debuted earlier with Alice, and I have to say, people absolutely lost their minds because you are making fresh pasta in your home and you are doing it at the best price that we have uh, found. So not only are you going to do angel hair, you can do spaghetti, you can do linguine, you can do fettuccine, you can do tagliatelle or tagliatelle, you can do rigatoni, you can do pasta sheets, you can do lasagna, you can do ravioli, and you can do it literally with the touch of a button. Plus, you can do frozen desserts or make your juice with this. I mean, seriously. So you have to understand, in the world of cooking, Chef Emeril Lagasse needs virtually no introduction. I mean, he's helping us kick it up a notch for our Let's Cook for the Holiday event here at HSN. So I know I just read off all the different um, things that you can do with this. Remember, it's also a juicer and a frozen dessert maker. And I heard Chef say this earlier, which I think is so smart. These discs, by the way, you there's no tomfoolery. They're easy to interchange. So, of course, you get um, your uh, measuring carafes. You get your cleaner. Here's that juicing attachment. And then you're also getting a great cookbook. But Emerald does have another cookbook. We'll give you that item number. But you get these two. And I think, Steve, you did say we, we have a, okay, we do have like a hardbound uh, cookbook as well. Love this. So anything from your juicers and your gelatos to 
Remember those meatballs, folks? The meatballs were hot, hot, hot earlier in this show. Well, now you've got your homemade spaghetti to go along with it. Um, there's that item number for the cookbook in the corner of your screen. So Chef Emeril Lagasse back where he belongs, as I like to say, at HSN. Oh, I feel so lucky. You were on with Alice earlier, and, and Alice, I know, she actually went to Italy and did the whole thing. I've saw, seen the pictures right. where she was making pasta. Listen, I love to be in the kitchen, but there's a real finesse with pasta, but there's also a generational love. If you want to create yes. that Sunday gravy, or I should say that Sunday pasta-making tradition, you want to talk about set it and forget it, I can put the ingredients in, and I've got fresh homemade pasta with no work, and you can't mess it up, right, Chef? Well, like you said, Shannon, uh, this is this is something that I love to do with the family. This is something that I love to involve with the children with. Like you said, you know what you're going to get. You're going to get the liquid measuring cup, the dry measuring cup, eight dyes of all the different pastas that you can make, as you can see that we've done. You get the cutter. And basically, this is three in one. So beside it being a pasta maker, okay, that's why it's pasta and beyond, it's also a juicer. You can see Claire, she's there over there juicing away some mandarins. Uh, we're gonna, we've got some spinach that we did earlier. Later on, we're gonna show you this uh, dessert treats that you can do also, so three in one. It's simple to use, folks. Simple instructions, this is what you do. You're gonna open up the machine. I'm gonna make a double batch of this. So I already have one cup of flour that's in here. I like using organic flour because it's, it's good, good for the family. It's really delicious. So you see that we have two cups of flour because we're making a double batch. A pinch of salt. We put the, put the machine back together. Now, push of a button, actually two. Now you can see that it's beginning with that powerful motor. It's starting to mix the flour away. In this little drip pan, what we did earlier is we juiced some spinach because now we're gonna take this and we're gonna turn it into spinach pasta. So I'm slowly drizzling that in our drip tray. And this, is, this process is gonna take, folks, about five minutes. Then automatically, automatically it's gonna go into the extruding mode all by itself. So you're not pushing any more buttons. What I said earlier about what's coming together, what's coming together folks, so they, there's the liquid. You got the dry and you got the liquid. That simple, pinch of salt. I have this little cutter that comes with it also, and also these little tools that, that you can clean the dyes much easier because hot soapy water and that's all really you need. So what's included is eight shapes of different pastas that you can do. Like Shannon said, you can make penne, you can make spaghetti, you can make linguine, tagliatelle, you can make udon noodles. Udon houses right now, these udon bars are the hottest thing right now in America. You can make your own udon as we did here with vegetables, healthy for the kids. You can make angel hair, fettuccine lasagna. Earlier today, and a little, in a little bit, Claire and I, we made some lasagna sheets, and then we just hand cut them to make like pompadel. It, it cooks fast. Remember, fresh pasta cooks faster than that typical box pasta. So you can see now that it's beginning to all incorporate. We have a beautiful color, okay? And just in seconds, you're gonna see that it's gonna go into the extruding mode, and we're gonna be extruding pasta. Now, you can see earlier what we did. We did carrot, we did a spinach, we did beet, we did a squid ink, and these are all the different sizes. And look, you're juicing away over there, Claire. Uh, these are all the different shapes of pastas that you can do. All you then need is just a little salted water, and we're gonna show you that in a little bit too. This is gonna be extruding any minute now and then we'll start having fresh pasta. That's how simple it is, Shannon. It, it is, okay, we have every service representative taking orders. People are absolutely going bananas over this. Uh, Sandy, I see you on Facebook, and you know what's so interesting, Sandy? I, I didn't even mean to do this. Sandy was asking if you could make the, the pasta low carb. Look what I turned to. 
or turn to. By the way, here's the cookbook. I'll show you some of the other recipes. Skinny pasta. Skinny pasta. Because remember, you're in complete control of your ingredients. So uh, this one actually uses um, whole wheat. So you can really, whether it's a rice flour, you can really put yourself in complete control. So whether you are vegan or you're trying to adjust the carbohydrate content or you want a higher nutritional content and you go for a whole wheat flour or a certain grain, and then, you know, you can really you know, be in complete control. Oh, chef, I'm dying to know what you've got. What, what are you making there in your kitchen? So this is what, now it's kneaded, and now it's gone into the extruding mode. So now it's beginning to start extruding the pasta, that simple, with a push of a button. So flour and juice if you want to juice. If you don't want to juice and you just want just plain uh, pasta, you can just use water, two eggs, uh, just a little couple of drops of olive oil, and that's your liquid that goes in there. I like to really sort of get get it about, oh, about eight inches before I cut it. But Shannon, let me tell you something. The pasta's warm coming out of the machine. It's that fresh. It's that fresh. And, and, and it's so easy. From here, it goes into water. Three, four minutes, you got a meal. You can decide what kind of pasta, involve the family, involve the kids. Look at this. And you know now, what, Chef? A family tradition has never been more easy because, you know, when grandma or your mom or yourself, when you're making pasta, it's, it's, a, it's a whole situation. It's like an afternoon. It's a lot of effort. This couldn't be any easier, right? No, look at this. See that? I just cut it. And look at that. I have beautiful, fresh pasta. Look at that. And we're gonna show you some, some dishes here shortly. Beautiful color from the juicer that we did. Just amazing, just fresh spinach. Like you said, you said a great point, Shannon. You're controlling how healthy this is, and this is pretty healthy, okay? This is pretty healthy. Now you can decide what kind of pasta dish that you wanna do. Claire and I right now are getting ready to do some butternut squash, and we're gonna, we're gonna show you a, a very simple pasta dish that we're gonna do. And look at this. It's just extruding beautiful fresh pasta. It's dynamite and done as only Chef Emeril Lagasse can do. Chef, everybody is so excited from Pat to Sandy to Barbara um, to Annie to my friend Annie and Beverly, of course, on Facebook. By the way, uh, hi there, Bobby. Nice to see you there as well. So, when is a pasta maker more than a pasta maker? Uh, <laughs> when Chef Emeril makes it for you. Most of you are grabbing the cookbook. So we have only 150 of the Pasta and Beyond cookbook. I should point out, and what's interesting is, if you weren't watching the presentation, you would say, now why in the world does he have sorbets? Why in the world does he have gelatos? Why in the way world does he have all these great dessert recipes? Because guess what? You're juicing and you're making dessert too with the same machine. I'm serious about that. How wild is that? 150 of you can get that cookbook. Um, okay. The phrase bull in a china shop you break it you buy it <laughs> boy chef i'll tell you some things don't change i've already dismantled part of the set thank goodness the pasta maker i can't mess up because remember you are doing angel hair spaghetti linguine fettuccine tagliatelle rigatoni pasta uh, you can do sheets of course you can do your lasagna you can do your ravioli but then it will also make your sorbets your frozen desserts and your juices Please, my apologies, Tim. My apologies to the team in the kitchen. I actually broke a glass on the set. Uh, so apparently I must think I'm in a Greek restaurant, like Opa. I think that's good luck somewhere. But you get your two. Hannah, I'm so sorry. I know. It was me. I know. Making more work for the kitchen team. I definitely don't need to do that. But your two different size carafes, your juicing attachment, and your extruder. Um, of course, the discs interchange. They're easy to clean. You get that cleaner. And then you also get the uh, measuring carafe. And then two, you do get two books included. But if you can do that pasta and beyond cookbook, that would be lovely. So remember, you're also juicing with this same machine. And you're doing it on FlexPay. Now, this is the lowest price that we have found anywhere. Do you know you can apply and buy? If you apply and buy, you're actually making, it's less than $100 to get this at home. So do that now. 
put it on FlexPay, you still get that extended holiday return policy. I'm telling you, once you try fresh pasta, you will never look back. Uh, for the holiday season, and Chef, I know you were talking about this with Alice because, you know, she grew up, I think she was talking about her grandmother making pasta. In my family, I, I'm kind of the family historian, so I try, to, I try to do all my grandma's recipes. Let me just tell you, grandma's recipes are a lot of work. I mean, they are. It's just, you know, it's, it's not easy. So now you can do grandma's recipes without all the work, without the weight, and no one is the wiser because it's still homemade and fresh goodness, isn't it? Yes, it is. I'll tell you what, you know what, one of the things that a lot of people have commented to me about is that, what about all of these accessory pieces? and all the dyes that it comes with. Well, we have a little home for it right in here that you just pop this out and you can store it so you're not losing your pieces. The other thing is, is that every single part, accessory part is labeled. So you know everything that you need to, 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 to know about assembling your special at attachments. And like I said, it's a three in one. So it's a pasta maker, a juicer, and a frozen dessert maker. It's unbelievable. If you want to make sorbet, you want to make a, a, a flavored ice cream, you want to do, it's, it's amazing, I'm telling you. And you know, in this beautiful Pasta and Beyond book, I just want to show you this, 137 recipes, tips and ideas to help liven up your meals, your drinks, look at this. All kinds of different pasta dishes in here. You just have to decide which one you want, which one your family wants, so you got three things that you got to ask yourself. When do I want to make it? What kind of pasta am I going to cook? And Shannon, the most important thing for you and I, when are we eating? Yeah, you took the words out of my mouth. <laughs> Seriously. By the way, Janice, you are right. We are so lucky to have our small, smart and multi-talented chef Emeril Lagasse with us uh, this hour. And Barbara, you're right. There's nothing like fresh pasta. Remember, with an unconditional money-back guarantee until the end of January, you could take this for a test drive. And no kidding, once you've tried fresh pasta, you, you will never look back. Good news is I've got one for you now. I think we're getting close to that 1,000 um, being spoken for. Okay, so almost 1,000 spoken for. There is an errand coming up with Amy and Adam, but I'm telling you right now, I would not wait. Get this headed your way. Oh, Chef, now, is this that combination of, um, was it butternut so, squash and carrot? So what we did is we, we made lasagna noodles, and Claire and I just cut them like large noodles, like, like pompadour. And now she's sort of doing like this uh, pumpkin pasta with this butternut squash, sort of like Alfredo style with sage, with fresh sage. You're gonna, oh, I, I wish you could smell this. It's, it's just incredible. The smell in the studio here, it's unbelievable. Look, we're making a different type of pasta now. See that? Oh, wow. So oh. here's it's, it's extruding right now. That looks awesome, Claire. We're gonna garnish that with just a little bit more sage, and boy, somebody's gonna be lucky eating that. You know how hungry you're making everybody on the set. <laughs> you know that, right? Oh, Shannon. If we could only be there. But you know what's so interesting, <laughs> Chef? Because I've seen you on all of the major cooking shows. Obviously, I've had the pleasure of being at one of your world-class restaurants. We miss having you here, but it's so nice to have you back on HSN. You know, sometimes when we would watch you on your cooking show, we'd, we'd say, oh, I love that, but I could never do that. I'm not Emerald. I don't have those skills. Don't take this the wrong way, but no skills required. So you can duplicate your celebrity experience or skills when you've got the right machine to do it, right? Exactly right. I mean, we take all the intimidation out of it for you folks. And I just want you to know, this is not about like Emerald putting his name on a box. I'm involved with the team from right from the design to testing, to retesting, retweaking the machine. We'll go back, we'll add things, we'll add features. That's how personal it is. And, and let me tell you something, the motor can also turn not only this pasta and beyond, but a frozen dessert maker as well, beside a juicer. I hope that you're seeing this, folks, because this is fresh pasta at its best. You decide if you want it plain, if you want a juice, if you want it maybe beet, maybe you want to do a carrot, maybe you, you want to do a squid ink, however you want to do it, then you can decide uh, 
what kind of pasta dish you want to make for the family. You we chose here this pompadel butternut squash with sage. It smells so good. The studio in here, there's something about when, when sage hits the heat a little bit, the steam, it just transforms it into something magical. It, it does indeed. Dee, I'm not sure if you um, remove the juice strainer when you make the frozen desserts. I'll check with Chef in a moment. But um, uh, Sandy, back to your question. Now, I, and I promise you, I didn't even do this on purpose. When we're talking about making skinny pasta, here's what's interesting. Because I've been experimenting with like some vegan options and Meatless Monday. Um, now, this is a spaghetti recipe that actually uses whole wheat flour and egg substitute. So when I say you are in complete control of your ingredients and anyone who has purchased, first of all, fresh pasta <laughs> from the grocery store, first of all, that doesn't exist. They always charge you more for those ones that are in the refrigerator or in the deli case. And it's not this, okay? Over a thousand gone. Remember, get that cookbook that if there are about a hundred of those to go around, certainly Chef Emerald gives you all the tips, the, you know, the, the keys to the kingdom with two other uh, books. Oh, the cookbook is gone, but uh, I'm sure they will work on restocking that. Um, and actually, Colleen, the, thank you for the comment on the shirt. That's actually part of my personal collection. The cookbook is gone. This should be part of your permanent collection in your kitchen. And once you start that family tradition, Chef, I really wasn't kidding. I mean, I love that you're doing all of these. You know, you're, you're doing the tagliatelle, you're doing um, your linguine, you're doing your lasagna, sh lasagna sheets, you are juicing. I'm not sure if you take out that juicing um, strainer when you do the frozen desserts or not. I don't think so, but I'll defer to the chef on that. Frozen but the family traditions are hard. I mean, I love doing them, but when I make my grandmother's rosette recipe or her lefsa or krumkaka it's a lot of work <laughs> it's a lot of work chef this is as easy as putting the ingredients in and starting a family tradition and the kids really love being part of the process don't they this is this is absolutely uh this is claire just made a little mango frozen dessert look at this right out right right out of the machine and oh my god Good. The concentration of flavor that that does, and then transforms it into a frozen dessert, either soft serve or sorbet. We have a few others that we made there, strawberry, mango, or chocolate one. It's unbelievable. That's all I'm going to tell you, my friend. I wish I could share it with you. I, I wish I could just, whoop, there you go. <laughs> I know, I'm so jealous. I seriously am. Uh, Chef, do you remember, did you take that strainer out when you were doing the frozen desserts? I'm trying to get that top off. Of course, with my arthritis, I won't be able to do it. But, um, but it just comes through that same attachment, right? Yes, yeah. So, folks, it's a three-in-one now. Remember, it's not just the pasta and beyond. It doesn't just make fresh pasta and all the different pastas that you can make. You can juice, so you know a lot of people are into juices. Those vegetable juices today, they're they're not they're not cheap, uh, and so you can make your own uh, and get as creative as you want by the juicer or make a frozen treat. Look oh, at you go! Look at that! Oh, I I'm, know. I'm serious. Can Ever you imagine how? Can you imagine how much fun you'd have? You know what we do? We we just pick a day usually on the weekend, and we, we're gonna do pasta that uh, afternoon, late afternoon. We make a couple of three different batches, a couple of three different sizes, juice one, maybe do a spinach, do a couple of egg ones. You know what, Shannon? You don't have to worry about it going bad. It keeps well in the refrigerator for days, and you can also freeze it. So that way, if you, you, you got a busy life during the weekday, like all of us do, and you just like in a pinch, you can just take that out. You can let it thaw for about 10 or 15 minutes. And wow, you've got fresh pasta just like that and decide what you want to do. And I, I wish you could smell this because Claire's got, she has olive oil working mm. and she has shaved garlic and crushed peppers. She's killing me with this. <laughs> and, she's, and she's got some of our fresh, what do you got, spaghetti? I'm gonna put some spaghetti right She's in. gonna put some spaghetti in the water now. Watch how fast this is, folks how this, this is gonna cook like in three minutes, and she's doing pasta, which's called oleolio, olio, which is olive oil, garlic, and crushed pepper. I eat this at least one night when I get home from the restaurant. This is like a go-to thing, Shannon. It's wow. delicious. Watch how fast this is gonna be. 
Oh my goodness. I mean, you can literally you see, see it cooking. You see the your pasta eyes. already coming? Yeah, yes. you see the pasta already coming? It's already floating already. It's, it's been like a minute and a half. Wow. Yeah. <gasps> oh, come look on. At, look, look at that. <gasps> and, 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 and you want some of that pasta water. You know, you don't be afraid that a little bit of that pasta water goes in there uh, because it's not, a, it's not a problem at all. Oh, yes. Oh, oh the yeah. smell is unbelievable. Remember, uses this uses that powerful motor that drives the mixing to just extrude. It needs and extrudes your, your, your mixed dough. It's very, very simple. Simple to use instructions, folks. That I promise you. You add your dry ingredients, your wet ingredients, you start the machine, you press the button, and you instantly are making fresh pasta. And, and, and it takes the fear factor out. Chef, it's something that you said. I, you, you know, even when I watched you judging some of those cooking competitions, it's that fear factor. It's like, oh, you made fresh pasta? Oh, you made fresh pasta? I mean, it, it throws just even, you know, skilled chefs in the kitchen for a loop. It, you're never thrown for a loop. And the fact that it is so versatile, hey, one of our questions uh, on Facebook was about um, uh, gluten, et cetera. Here's, here's a good example of how you can be in customized control of your ingredients. Ramen and udon noodles are so in, in vogue. They're so on trend right now. Guess what? You're doing it. So that means you can choose, like, say, a, a rice flour, which, of course, eliminates that gluten content. Now, I'm just speaking from myself because, you know, I, I, I do try to fandangle my diet with healthy choices as I, I can. Pasta is back on the menu. I mean, it really is. Whether you're boosting the nutritional content with some of the juices that you see chef doing or whether you're doing your own sorbets and frozen desserts, because remember, it's also a juicer and a frozen dessert maker, like cantaloupe and melon and you know, uh, gelatos, oh my, you're doing all of that. But then you're also doing your uh, lasagna, you're doing your ravioli, you're doing your pasta sheets, you're doing your rigatoni, you're doing your tagliatelle, you're doing your fettuccine, you're doing your linguine, you're doing your spaghetti, you're doing your angel hair, and you're doing it for the lowest price that we have found, the lowest price that we have found. And I will say this, oh, in fact, um, for those of you out there with it's even things like um, pot stickers or ravioli. Remember, you have to think outside of even the pasta box because it will do pasta sheets. You could do your own well, ravioli, just like we're saying, but those little um, uh, pasta pillows. You can get really creative with this. As I said, you're in the driver's seat, whether you're watching gluten or carbohydrate or vegan. Um, you can substitute egg substitutes, your own specialized flour. You can boost the nutritional content with juices but you can do it now. So it's our big cooking event, our largest cooking event here at HSN, and it is the lowest price that we have found. It is on five flex pays, which mirrors what we would have done if we would have had enough to make this a today's special, and it's less than $30 to get home. Unconditional money back guarantee until the end of January. Take it for a test drive. Start a new family tradition in your family. I know the kids, the grandkids, your whole family, they will be fascinated. One of our uh, friends on Facebook said, oh, you know, it looks like one of those little machines you played with as a kid. Well, you know what? It, you do feel like it's playtime. It's not agonizing. We're taking the stress and we're taking out the mess because that's the other thing about making pasta chef. Um, if people are downsizing in their kitchen, you know, it requires a lot of room and a lot of mise en place. You know, you get the mound of flour, you're putting the egg in the, the mound and you're kneading, you're doing this. And then you got the, the pasta sheet maker that you're rolling out. It's, it's, it's hard to do it perfectly. I know I keep saying this, but yeah, it's the taste, it's the flavor, but doggone it at the end of the day, it's the ease of use that really makes us a winner, isn't it? It, it, you're absolutely right. And we take all the guesswork out of it with, with, our, with our measuring cups, both dry and our wet measuring cup. You can't, you can't go wrong. A pinch of salt and you're making pasta. And remember, there's also, as I said, there's that built-in storage unit here, okay? Right here, that all of those pots and pieces go right in there. So you're really just literally taking your machine with the plug and putting it on your countertop and you'll be using it a lot, I promise you. Uh, there's nothing better than and fresh pasta, the family, the kids, and with the holidays coming up, they're right here. 
all the different things that you can make, the seasonal things, whether it's like you said, Hanukkah, or, or whatever, it's, it's just endless what you can do. It's a matter of what you want to do, whether you're using the recipe book or you go online or whatever, maybe a, an old favorite dish of yours. One of our, one of our favorites that we do with the family, we, we, make a, we make a bolognese, but we don't use ground meat. Sometimes we'll use pork, beef, and, and veal, but there's sometimes that we'll just use ground turkey. We want a little bit healthier, just ground turkey, a little salt, pepper, a little celery salt, a little crushed red pepper, and just let that simmer with, with, with your favorite red sauce, and then, or not, or just olive oil, and then you put that fresh pasta in there. Look at what Claire's doing right now. Wow. She's she took our spinach pasta that we made first, and now she's doing another dish just like that. That pasta cooked, I want to say, three minutes. Look at how beautiful that looks, right? And she's just lightly seasoning it. Yeah, so did one with olive oil, and now she's sort of doing this sort of almost like Alfredo style. Look at, look at how good that, oh, goodness. And she's got fresh spinach in it. I mean, that simple, folks, it's that simple. Fresh pasta cooks faster than your box one. And I'll tell you what, this powerful motor can run this pasta and beyond, whether you're juicing, whether you're making frozen treats, or you're making whatever kind of pasta you want. You, it, this is really going to change the way you think about pasta. It, it is indeed. And you know what? People are excited. Um, Sandy's loving the event. Mary says, happy Thanksgiving, Emerald. Uh, Tracy is excited to get this. Uh, Susan is excited. Um, and honestly, Teresa, nice to have you there. Thank you for the kind comment. Pat, we love having you here too. Sandy wants this. You know, the thing is, you do get that money back test drive, as I like to call it, until the end of January. So if this is tempting your taste buds and it really is, because I think we're actually over a thousand of them now spoken for, get it at home and start that family tradition. And it's the easiest family tradition that you're ever going to have. You know, my sweet grandmother, I, I lost her you know, many years ago, but I try to keep the family recipes alive. But grandma knows even when she was teaching me, whoo, it takes work. So this does not require any effort. So no one has to know. You could even say, listen, I'm bringing the fresh pasta to Thanksgiving. First of all, people are going to lose their minds. I'm like, oh, you went to so much trouble. You shouldn't have done that much work. No one has to know you put the ingredients in and hit a button. I mean, seriously. And then the fact that it cooks literally in a couple of minutes, you... It's a changing day. You can all hear how excited we are. Puts you in control of your ingredients. Almost 1,200 already gone. Lowest price anywhere. Lowest price that we have found. And remember, you could apply and buy. In that case, it's less than 100 bucks if you get that apply and buy promotion. How cool is that? But then we also have our extended holiday return policy and FlexPay. So you can put this on your PayPal, your debit card, Zulily, Q card, HSN card. I use my debit card. And then um, actually it's $27 and change to get it at home and take it for a test drive and have some fun with it. And remember, frozen desserts and juices as well. You're in the driver's seat. Chef, it's interesting because um, everyone who's been watching you in this presentation and with Alice, you're making us all hungry and you're making it attainable, not only for the best price and for the multitasking capabilities, but I know I keep going back to the ease. Correct me if I'm wrong, even in the, uh, as a professional chef, I mean, certainly not you, but when you judge these cooking competitions, there is a big fear factor that's associated with making fresh pasta, isn't there? You're right. Not only about making fresh pasta, but making frozen treats. Claire's got it in a little uh, baby little mason jar now, and you lit them and put them in your freezer. And when you're ready for that little treat, it's going to be ready for you. But like you said, this will take all the intimidation out of what people think is such a rocket science of making pasta. It's very simple, folks. And as, as I demonstrated earlier, and I'm gonna tell you about it right now, it's flour. You decide whether you want a single batch or a double batch. A double batch is about a pound of fresh pasta, which is perfect. You, you can also decide, do you want to juice? Do you want to juice spinach? Do you want to juice carrots? Or do you want to just do an, a, an egg pasta like, like what we did earlier? Two eggs, water, 
a couple of drizzles of uh, a couple of drops of olive oil that goes in the dry ingredients. You press the button, two buttons actually. It begins to start kneading and kneading and kneading about four or five minutes. It goes into an automatic extruding where the pasta begins to come out. Folks, you can get as creative as you want with your family and you will have a great time. Involve the family, involve the children, come together, make some pastas. Like I said, you can put some in the ice box, you can freeze some. Whenever you're ready for that great pasta dish, you're gonna have it. It's gonna taste delicious. I promise you, you're gonna taste the difference. You will. Sandy was requesting a BAM, um, uh, their chef. You know, I'm just, I'm passing along, you know. So. Bam, bam. <laughs> I love it. Chef, I, I know we'll see you in Amy and Adam's show a little bit later. My love to you. Everybody was commenting and complimenting uh, Claire as well. So my best to you and your whole team. We'll look forward to seeing you a little bit later tonight, my friend. Absolutely. Thank you so much. And we really, really appreciate it. Great, wor great working with you. Always a pleasure. Thank you so Happy much, Chef. Happy holidays, everyone. Happy holidays. Hey, and Steve, do we have any of the pressure cooker remaining or this day only? We might be able to give you a reminder.